Hello friends, today we are going to make a contribution to the Flutter Wordle app under GDSC, Autumn of Code 2022. Now, when contributing to a repository on GitHub, first see what the repository does by looking at a readme file. Second, go to the issues tab and pick an issue. Now here there is only one issue, so let's go to it. Please read the issue body to see what the issue is about. Now, if you can see how to do the issue, ask the maintainers to assign it to you by making a comment. Once you make the comments, the maintainers will assign the issue to you, as depicted here. Once the issue has been assigned to you, you can start contributing to it. Now, the first step to contributing is to fork the repository to your own github account. Now I first click the fork button on the top right corner of the github and then I click, click the create fork button. After clicking the create fork button, the repository is copied to my github account. Once the repository has been copied, we can start contributing by copying the repository URL from github and then going to um, clone the repository on your own system by typing git clone followed by the repository URL. As you can see here, the repository could not be cloned because I had al already cloned it to my PC. The next step is to open the repository in your VS Code. Now you can simply do that in your own terminal by typing code followed by the name of the repository which you can find out by typing ls in the terminal. So now I type code flutter wordle app which opens this repository in my VS Code. Now let's see what the issue wants us to do. The issue wants us to add repositories to the uh, spec.yaml file which records the dependencies of the project. So let's go to the pub spec.yaml file. After opening the pub spec.yaml file, we see that it defines the project name, description, published to, and all other information, but also there is a dependencies section. Now let's see what the issue tells us to do. The issue says that the, the dependencies section should have Equitable, Flipkart, and Flutter SDK along with Equitable which is already present. So let's add the remainder of the entries by copying them from here. And pasting them in this file like this. And adjusting the indentation. Okay. Once you have made the changes to the file, the step now is to commit these changes with git. Committing records the changes in git by making a snapshot. To do this, we first make a new branch. To make a new branch, type git switch hyphen c followed by the name of the new branch. Let's say the new, new, new branch is fix issue followed by the name of the, the number of the issue which is done. This brings us to a new branch. After making a new branch, we make a git comment by first executing the git add command followed by the name of the file that we want to commit. In, which, in this case, it's, this is pubsec.yaml. However, it looks like it's not, so let's try to fix that. Okay, perfect. Now 
वी कैन मेक अ गेट कमेंट बाय टाइपिंग गेट कमेंट फॉलोड बाय हाई सन एम फॉलोड बाय द कमेंट मैसेज विच इज शोन ऑन गेट हब सो इन दिस केस लेट्स से फिक्स डिपेंडेंसीज As soon as you hit enter, after this command, you'll see that Git says that it has made a commit. We can verify this by typing Git log, which gives us a list of commits, as can be seen here. Now, let's push these changes to GitHub, as in upload them to GitHub, by the Git push command. Now we ran into an issue here because Git is telling us that we need to um, specify an upstream branch. An upstream branch is a branch that um, always carries the changes of a local branch in your own computer. Let's just copy and paste the change suggested by Git. Soon as you hit enter on the command, you can see that Git indicates success. Now we can go back to our repository on GitHub, and as soon as we go back, we see that GitHub has this banner for us, which says that fix issue one had recent pushes less than a minute ago. This was the git push command that we just made. But even if we did not have this, we can verify that the new branch has been made by clicking on the branches button here we can see the fix issue one branch now let's make a pull request by going back to the repository the main repository and going on the pull request button after we go on the pull request tab we can see that there is a button here to compare and make a pull request we will click on that and we can see that the title has already been populated for us and in the body we will describe the changes that we have made and that this uh, pull request fixes hashtag the issue number one by adding missing dependencies And we can the pull request. And there you go, your first ever open source contribution on GitHub.